What's up everyone and welcome back and not actually back we're gonna be doing something new today Which is we're gonna be unboxing the new Dragon Ball card game stuff That Panini just came out with this is a new set I know he's probably seen a lot of people do it by now, but I had a little bit of an error with my cards, which is uh, They didn't come in the box and I didn't check my email for like three days and they said hey We're not gonna be able to send these to you in the box We could just send you 24 packs and I was like alright well if I knew that then I would have just you know told you that was fine to begin with so we're gonna be opening um, probably 10 of those packs because I'm gonna be going over the starter deck today which is what you actually see in front of you right now I'm gonna move my microphone really quick all right so this is the oh, I went the wrong way with it this is the starter deck for it says right here um, well hey, I'll move it up a little bit it says starter deck right here I don't know if you guys can really see that or not because it doesn't look like the camera's focusing this is like my first time using this in like three or four years so I, uh, I'm still not 100% uh, familiar with how this actually works. So, um, and this is this is gonna be like a this this is gonna start the wrong way. So I I gotta flip it. So if stuff looks weird with my hands. That's why, um, because I actually like had it on upside down. So let's see. Oh, there's another one right there. Um, so we're, we'll go over the starter deck, and this is the same for for everybody. I'm pretty sure. But uh, you get a bunch of cards right here. We'll go over what those are in just a moment. I believe this is the. This is the directions right here. This is the rule manual, rule sheet, as you can see. Well, it tells you everything about the game. Obviously, it is a rule sheet. So, yeah, introduction, blah, 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 blah. It's got all this stuff about cards, which you probably can't see, because I, I gotta actually look into this, my, uh, this webcam and actually remember how it works, because, like I said, I haven't used it in quite a while, and the reason I stopped using it before is because it was a really not the greatest quality uh, this is I believe a play sheet right here so this is this is the actual sheet for the placement of cards and stuff so um, that's actually upside down when I flip the video so um, yeah it's like got some stuff there and I can't zoom it out all the way because it's not a, not the best setup but uh, we'll open this pack really quick move that out of the way I should put that on the floor because I need this area over here to place cards. So uh, we'll open this. In the back of these cards, unless it's a leader card, all look like this. They got the Dragon Balls design. I'll actually unwrap it first and then show you guys if I can remember how to open a pack. It's been quite a while since I had to open a pack. And I don't actually really play card games. I just, uh, I'm in this for the collection purposes. I'm just probably going to throw them in a binder and then get rid of whatever I don't need, which is. Uh, pretty much the extent of it because these cards have really good art even like the commons that I'll go over with you guys have like amazing art so that's why that's why I pretty much got into these these specifically anyway and like I, I used to collect like Yu-Gi-Oh cards when I was a kid just for the way they looked but then I stopped so broke the seal on that finally so get a uh, I don't exactly know that, that that looks about good so um, let me fix my lighting really quick actually Alright, the glare was a little intense and it still might be just because of the this is this uh, ceramicness. But you get this uh, Super Saiyan blue card, which is also a Super Saiyan God card. I uh, I really like the art on this. Probably can't see it the best because this isn't the greatest camera quality. But I'll, I'm gonna look into it afterwards. So actually, I, I like this card quite a bit though. This is a Super Saiyan God Goku turns into a Super Saiyan blue Goku. I like the art on both sides. That's a card that. So this is the one of the starter cards because uh, it says right down here it says. Uh, ST oh, it says uh, SD1-01 ST which is the the code for the starter the five starter cards all have ST after them and the next one we actually didn't get them in the right order but next one is going to be a uh, Vegeta and the other side is not anything special this is just a normal one it doesn't awaken it doesn't have an awakening like the other one does I was trying to see if I could get rid of that that little bit of glare that was left but it just looks like that's going to be a thing on the cards that have the little um thing on them so uh we actually get two starter gokus uh this is just a normal super saiyan god goku it's got twenty five thousand attack though which actually means he's a little bit better power wise than the than the super saiyan blue card so that's kind of cool uh, i'm gonna just throw that over there really quickly i actually turn these around so you guys uh you guys can kind of see them the next one that's going to be up just trying to I, I i didn't spend a lot of time trying to figure out this setup so um, next we got a another Goku. Just throw that over there. Got another Goku, another Goku. 
We have Super Saiyan 3 Goku. I'm not the huge, I'm not the biggest fan of this art. It's it's all right, but it it's definitely got a couple of uh of things I don't really particularly like about it. Throw that off to the side. Get another one right here. You get a Spirit Bomb Goku from the Battle of Gods movie or the anime or whatever form you chose to get it in. And then you get another Vegeta like you saw earlier. It's got this uh this one I actually must have got a alternate card art for that. Hold on. Just a moment yeah so this uh, we'll put these side by side these are the same card but one's got a little bit of an alternate art so that's actually kind of cool it's uh it's a little bit like uh it's kind of shiny and that's actually well we dropped the card that's actually kind of cool I, i'll definitely take that all right you get another goku another goku another goku not quite low enough so do that so I, I put them out of frame again my bad on that one and you get a couple Gohans. I'm not going to go over this whole deck. So, we'll go 10, go 10, and Vegeta. I'll just set this. This is the starter deck, so I'll just set this off to the side really quick. i got to gather up the cards I set off to the side, too. This is just the starter deck. We're actually going to go over more over the booster box today, which isn't really a box for me. It's uh, it's just a UPS envelope with uh, with a bunch of card card packs, and as you can see, they're all, all in there. There's... You can see, you only see a few, but there's about, there's all 24 in here. I made sure that I counted. So, since uh, since I went over the starter deck, let's do eight packs this video. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And we will do the other, let's see, we'll do the other 16 tomorrow. Because, not a whole lot going on in Doka Battle right now anyway, so it, it wouldn't hurt to spread stuff out a little bit. But, um, I'll leave the packs, packs over here yeah all right it seems like that's a good spot for him all right so we're gonna open a champa pack first actually this is the, the pack that we're gonna be diving into first so um and i apologize if it takes me a super long time to open these packs because i have like i said i haven't opened a card pack in a very very long time just for uh just for opening purposes why can't i get this open is the better question All right, there we go. All right, so you get 12 pack of cards in a pack, and you get one guaranteed rare or higher. And I believe in a booster box, you're actually guaranteed four premium rares. So I don't, I don't actually know what those are. So um, let's actually move these a little more off the off the screen so I can put a little more focus on the cards. So let's uh, let's flip them over one by one. Is that the right way? No, it's not. All right, so there we go. First card is going to be a Super Saiyan. Goku from I believe this is from Frieza Saga. Yeah, this is right there. It's a Frieza Saga, and this is a this is an SR. So down in the bottom corner, you can actually tell what the cards are. That's why I said ST for the other ones because they're starter rares. So this is a uh, this is a super rare card actually. So that must have been my my r rare or higher for the pack. I'm actually not sure if that's the case, but anyway, um, turn it. Oh, I would I did that the wrong way. I think no. Okay, it's upside down. It's weird because I'm recording this. Everything's got to be upside down. But we're gonna get a Magetta right here. And uh, this card cannot be KO'd in battle, so it's actually a pretty useful card, honestly, for a for an uncommon. It wasn't uncommon, by the way. Um, I'm gonna get a Vados and Trunks. This is gonna be the Broly. Broly is one of the best decks right now, so this card is actually really useful. If I decide to run a Broly deck, if I can pull a Broly, um, and if I ever actually play the card the card game, that's upside down. Um, this is gonna be a Jocko, a Dodoria. Trunks, Vegeta, Trunks, once again, different Trunks though, not a few, not a Teen Trunks, Zarbon, and it looks like it's just a normal Vegeta card. Alright, so that was the first pack, got seven more to go, um, we'll see if I can actually get them open, that's going to be the big question right here, I actually think there's, new, I think there's a little bit of an easier way to do this, after I get this open, finally. If, if that ever happens. Um, actually, would it be easier to just do it this way? Oh, yeah, there's a little pull thing over here. All right, that's cool. So we'll do it that way because that actually makes more sense. Let's do it this way, too, so I can just go through the cards and set them off to the side and get on with my life. So that's Magetta again. Ooh, it's actually a, uh, a Gohan card. It doesn't look like it's the, the most amazing card, but it is a common, so I guess I shouldn't expect too much out of it. We're getting another Jocko. This is actually a different Jocko, although the, the card art itself is actually pretty much the same. Senzu Bean. Uh, Burger from the Ginyu Force. 
Goten. Gotamo. Another Goten. Uh, Monica. And hey, we get the Vados. This is the uh, this is one of the leader cards actually. So um, yeah. Th so this card starts as it starts. You played as this. You played as this Vados right here, and then you do an awakening, which I don't actually know how to do yet. And uh, you get this as your card. So what, what is this card's skill actually? This card can attack battle cards in active mode. Or all right, that seems like it should be. When this card attacks, draw one card. If this a card attacks a battle card, it gains plus 5,000 power for the duration of the turn. Alright, so that is actually pretty solid. Uh, we get a King Vegeta right here. And then, oh, we get a Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta. It's not a it's not a leader card, but this has really nice art, actually. It's one of the like the shiny cards. So I'll definitely have to put that in the, in a in a sleeve and make sure that that stays protected. Alright, I had to take a short break, but we are, we are back now. We got uh, six more packs to go, including this one, so... Um, let's keep going, and uh, this is actually a Goku pack. So this this card this uh, um, pack actually looks really cool, honestly. Um, I like that a lot. All right, so if I can get the cards out of here, we'll actually go through them. So start out with a base form Go Tanks. So that's not too bad. Um, Sui, uh, I never actually knew that person's name. Vegeta, uh, the Frieza soldiers from the Resurrection F movie. The Piccolo, Frost. Which is actually one of the, the specific cards for this pack because it's a Universe 6 Saga themed pack. You get a Goku. Yeah, another Gohan, which actually 25,000 attack is pretty good. Oh, we get the greatest character in Dragon Ball Z history, uh, Bio Broly. So that that's also really awesome. That's something I really wanted. Now you get a Beerus. So that's a that's a uncommon actually, so that's cool. Um, and this is the this is a Super Saiyan Gohan, which is actually a leader card. So he starts out as this like it looks like Ultimate Gohan, but I guess it's not. And then uh, it turns into this, so it's a leader card. What does this card do? So when this card attacks, draw one card. That's his auto skill. And uh, choose one of, once a turn, choose all of your opponent's battle cards in the battle arena and KO them. All right, that seems kind of broken. but And then we get this Vados. So this is the special card art, I guess. No, it's just shiny for no reason in particular. All right, moving on. Let's uh, let's get it. this last or this pack. Another Goku pack, actually. And we'll uh, we'll see what we can do. So we start out with a Sui once again. Go tanks. A uh, normal base Goku. All right. Maybe we'll get a Kaba. Not a very good card. Five thousand is this limit, but it's cool, I guess. Uh, Frost, Sun, Go Ten, Jace, uh, Broly's ring. So another card that's key for the Broly. Broly uh, deck right here. I think you need three of these for uh, for that deck in particular. Tagoma, result of training. Hey, we get the Beerus, the leader Beerus, and we get a Super Saiyan Gotenks. I'll set that off to the side though, really quick. Let's look at this Beerus. So this is the one of the leaders again. This is Beerus. Um, so when you awaken him, auto skill is when this card attacks, draw one card, then choose one of your opponent's battle cards with an energy cost of three or less and KO it uh, and uh, activate main skill is switch this card to rest mode you win this game okay that seems very strange that that would exist and then the Super Saiyan Gotenks just has a 25,000 attack other than that he's uh I don't actually know what he does I'm not gonna look at every every single skill just the ones for the leader cards because I I've, I've only seen a couple of leader cards I tried to stay out of the loop on this game for the most part until my packs came so all right, so Goku, once again, full power energy. So this is like a support card. This is a better Frost. This is actually a decent Frost. This is a common card, though. So another Gohan. Kaba's Awakening. A Sun Goten card. Champa. Sun Goten, or Gohan, excuse me. Now we get another Beerus right here, so I got a dupe of that. Hit. Raccoon Eraser Gun. And we get another uh, Super Saiyan Goku from, it looks like, Frieza Fight and bad glare just because of this all this is like shiny and it's really cool to look at but it's just kind of hard to transfer all right so we're over over halfway through we got three more packs to go and every single no i was going to say every single one of them looks like it's a broly pack but the last one is a super saiyan blue goku pack and if i can get around the cards without damaging them we can actually open the packs so uh i i didn't open this the most efficient way but I actually got tape plastic on my finger or my thumb and it's still stuck to my thumb. Alright, so start out with a Kaba. Um, actually, pointed toward the 
camera. That's Frieza, Cold Bloodlust, Sui. And we got a normal Broly. Family Kamehameha. I really love the card art on this. And uh, it's not showing up the greatest just because this isn't the most spectacular webcam ever. But it, it looks really cool. Human Shield, Krillin. Get another Frost, just the 5,000. Uh, Sorbet's Attack. Hey, you get a Super Saiyan Blue Goku card. This uh, this has really good card art too. That was the reason that I really wanted to get these cards. And like, even though I don't play card games for the most part, is just like I wanted I wanted the art on these because even like this is like this is an uncommon and he has great art. This is like an uncommon and he has really good art. Botamo, full power Sun Gohan. This is the one that we looked at before. He evolves from the Ultimate Gohan looking one, and we get the Golden Frieza. This is a this is a really good card actually. Super rare, which I believe is the highest rarity in this game so far. Um, so that's cool. I really love this art too. It is really good. All right. Two more packs to go, and then we will be out of here for today, and we'll open the rest of the box tomorrow. You know, it's not really a box, it's just the rest of the packs, because it was pretty much like I bought 24 packs at a discount because I didn't get the box. I'll have to buy an empty box at some point, but I got a discount because they were just packs, because they were like, hey, we're really sorry, so I will definitely take it. All right, Senzu Bean, U6 Supreme Kai, a Super Saiyan Vegeta card, Sarban, uh, Krillin, I'm actually in the center of the camera. Kai Attendant Universe 6, Majin Buu, Frieza, Result of Training once again, get a Kid Gohan, this is actually a really good card art too, Frost, and Full Power Frieza is going to be our rare card for this one. Alright, so, last pack, and all these cards are falling down, so actually I have to take care of them after this, after this is over, so, that's not a big deal though, alright. I might keep some of these empty packs too, just because they look... They actually look really good, although I mutilated most of them opening it, so. I'll have to try. I'll, I'll like, maybe, like, I'll pre-open some packs next, off-camera, so that I can just keep them uh, for, for the next video. So, we'll start out with a Frieza. Trunks. And actually make it, I'm going to make a new pile, even though there's, like, very few cards left, so. Jocko. Champa. Trunks. Birder. Oh, I went the wrong way with that. Jocko again. And then we get another Super Saiyan Gohan. Bio Broly, greatest card in existence. A Monica. And our last card of the day is going to be a Vegeta card. So, that does it for this video. We opened uh, opened eight packs today. And all of them pretty much are right here. It's just a pile of garbage. But I'll be coming back tomorrow with another video. We're going to be finishing off these packs and see if we can pull anything. We got 16 packs next time because I don't. I'm not going to go over the starter again, which is why I only did eight this video. So... Anyway, that is going to do it for me. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And stay tuned for the next video of the Dragon Ball Super Card Game Galactic Battle Booster Pack Unboxing.